Good morning. Right, my Vauxhall Insignia has come up with an engine management light. Now, it's not a major concern on this car because what it means is there's something wrong with my emissions system on it. So I can still drive the car, but I've got an emissions issue, which is an MOT failure. Now, to take my car to the local garage to have it put on a diagnostic machine is £60 plus VAT, which I don't know whether you've ever seen one of these being used, but it's five minutes work tops. Anyway, what I've done is I bought this simple motor power diagnostic tool. Because all I need is a code, then I will know how to fix it and what it's going to cost. And you might say, well, what if it doesn't fit? Well, that's absolutely fine because I'm within the seven day period and I will send it straight back. But as of January 2024, this MP69033 is £17.50 from Amazon. A no-brainer. Anyway, let's open the box and have a look inside. Right, let's open the box and you, you don't need to see me opening that. And what you get is a user manual. And here we have, I don't want to damage anything because I might have to send it back. And there is a diagnostic tool. I'll show you where this plugs in on this car. On the insignia, just walked in under the seat. And there you can see that's where the diagnostic plugs in. And I pull out, pull out, pull out, pull out, pull out, pull out. And there you can go by where I am, you can see where it plugs in. Thank you. For okay, we've plugged this in. And here we are, it's linking to the vehicle. And it shouldn't link because I haven't got the ignition on. So we'll give it a go. There you go, failed to connect. So you put the ignition on. Here we go. There we go, so we go back again. And we go up. Click OK. And it's linking to the car. One code found. Read codes, OK, and there you go, two codes, you can see there we've got another code which is the same code, P229FOX, OK, we go back, erase codes, I'll see if I can erase them, OK, yes, OK, erasing codes, Erase your failure would not let me do that. So if I turn the engine on, there we go. Let's see if it will let me erase the code, shall we? Okay, yes, wouldn't let me erase them. Now, what it can do, yes, I want to exit that. What you can do with this, I believe, is a language, you can change that, go down, engine RPM, we'll go down to that, see if it's reading it, there we go, 933 RPM there, you can see that in the corner, reading it, simple stuff. There you go, 932 is the RPM. Okay, go back. And it does things I can't understand. I don't know what that is. But basically, you can see here, I wanted to, uh, code's found. So it, is, it has actually cleared them. No codes are stored. There we go. So we'll see how we go from there. 
and see if it comes back. The engine management light has gone out since I've cleared it with the diagnostic machine and what I'll do is, is I'll see what the code means and double check what parts I need and I'll leave it for a week and if the management light doesn't come on I guess it could have just been caused by the cold weather or just been a blip. Thank you for watching.